Okay, we've got live images coming in from Ahmedabad, the vibrant Gujarat summit where Prime Minister Narendra Modi and his guest of honor from the UAE, Mohammed bin Zayed, are observing a guard of honor. United Arab Emirates, Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan is in India on an official visit and here he is in Ahmedabad in these live pictures with Prime Minister Modi to participate in vibrant Gujarat 2024. Mohammed bin Zayed is the third president of the United Arab Emirates under whose leadership India UAE ties have gone to new heights. Prime Minister Modi has visited several times before a relationship that is taken extremely seriously in the linkages between India and West Asia. The vibrant Gujarat summit in its... Uh... The vibrant Gujarat summit is something that Pr uh, Prime Minister Modi had begun as Chief Minister Modi of Gujarat and it has continued year on year and continues to be a big ticket event in the Gujarat government calendar in terms of global investment attraction. It is a showpiece for the Gujarat model, as it were. And this year, it is Mohammed bin Zayed, a high-profile guest of honor at the vibrant Gujarat summit. The two leaders will be on a three-kilometer, a short three-kilometer road show as well to amplify the importance of both this diplomatic relationship, the fact that the UAE is a major investor in India. There could be some bigger investments and announcements from the UAE for India as part of this summit as well. Mohammed bin Zayed, Modi relationship, a very, very important one of the decade. राष्ट्रपति हैं उनके बीच लगातार हाई लेवल कांटेक्ट अगर हम कहें तो वो इस वर्ष देखने मिला है प्रधानमंत्री नरेंद्र मोदी हाल ही में कॉप 28 के लिए यूएई की यात्रा पर गए थे जहां पर उन्होंने एक संबोधन भी किया था। The guard of honor is almost over. The Prime Minister of India and Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan, the President of the United Arab Emirates, will shortly embark on a road show. You have a tri services band that is uh, given a uh, an official military welcome to the leader of the United Arab Emirates. He's the third president of the UAE. And under his presidency of the UAE, India, UAE relations have gone to new heights, both in terms of trade, in terms of cooperation, in terms of national security. Here you have the president of the UAE shaking hands with the national security advisor, Ajit Doval, and these are pictures of the hug between the two leaders earlier in the day. Here he is with External Affairs Minister S. Jay Shankar. I'm going to get those pictures from the airport from earlier today in just a moment so you can see that, uh, that hug, that welcome that the Prime Minister gave to the visiting leader of UAE. There you have it, the hug to welcome Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed, the President of the United Arab Emirates at the Ahmedabad airport. Very, very warm embrace, underscoring and amplifying a close personal relationship between these two leaders. The body language and the bonhomie between Sheikh bin Zayed and Narendra Modi has in many ways been a catalyst for relations between the two countries and that is precisely what you're seeing on full display now. Here's the road show that you're seeing taking place, the cavalcade with the Prime Minister and Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed of the United Arab Emirates making its way through Ahmedabad towards the venue of the vibrant Gujarat Summit 2024. Brijesh Joshi is our reporter on the ground in Ahmedabad. Brijesh, uh, this roadshow uh, is a great show of the relationship between India and the United Arab Emirates. Take us through the events of today. A guard of honor has just taken place, Brijesh. Roadshow is taking place now. What next? Uh, see, uh, right now the PM Modi and UA president has uh, left the Ahmedabad airport uh, and you can see the uh, uh, the convoy of the uh, PM Narendra yes. Modi and 
uh, UAE uh, President uh, Al Nahyad. So this is the uh, this is the convoy which is passing through Ahmedabad Airport. People have gathered here in a huge uh, uh, huge amount. The crowd is huge. Uh, all the BJP uh, karikatas or the cadres uh, have welcome uh, gathered here to welcome PM Modi and uh, UAE President. So this is a kind of a, a mega road show uh, for both the nations, uh, India and UAE. Uh, it is kind of a, a signature of PM Modi uh, that he uh, tries to show to the world that uh, he has a bone home with the leaders who are coming to uh, Gujarat in his own state. Uh, he uh, This will be the uh, 12th uh, state head who has visited uh, since 2014 uh, to Gujarat or Ahmedabad. So this is a big achievement on a uh, PM Modi side, personal side, uh, that uh, 12 state heads have been visited Gujarat or Ahmedabad after Narendra Modi has become the Prime Minister of India. Uh, so uh, uh, this is the uh, this is a big opportunity for the Gujarat as well ahead of the uh, vibrant Gujarat Global Summit's uh, 10th edition which will be inaugurated uh, 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 tomorrow at 10 a.m. Uh, but right now uh, they are just passing through the Ahmedabad airport. They reach to the uh, Taj Circle then they will move on uh, to uh, uh, Indira Bridge and uh, after all the, the last destination is uh, Hotel Leela where uh, PM Modi will host the uh, UA President uh, Gala Dina uh, and there will be a bilateral talk uh, between uh, both the leaders. Uh, so the ceremonial welcome has been done on the airport and there will be a bilateral talk at Hotel Leela around 7 p.m. and, there, and after that uh, there will be a Gala Dina uh, in, uh, for the uh, UA President hosted by the uh, Prime Minister of Bharat. So uh, this is the uh, program for tonight. Uh, from tomorrow morning onwards, uh, the yes. early program will be of the Vibrant Gujarat uh, Global Summit. So uh, this is the uh, program right now going on. The road show is there, seven kilometer long road show uh, where PM Modi and UA president are in the same car. Uh, they are uh, getting the welcome of the people of Gujarat, people of Ahmedabad. Uh, most of them are the BJP Karikata, but still uh, there are the people who are mm -hmm. welcoming uh, their beloved son, uh, PM Modi, uh, in Ahmedabad. Yes, Shiv. Amazing. Uh, you know, uh, the, the images are very, very telling. Like I said, it's a close personal relationship between these two uh, national leaders, the Prime Minister and Sheikh bin Zayed. They've met many times before uh, in, in the UAE. The Prime Minister was recently uh, at, the, at the COP summit as well, the weather summit where he had met uh, uh, Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed. So this is their second meeting in just the last few weeks. Uh, the Prime Minister, uh, under his leadership and these two leaders, they've managed to... Uh, expand India UAE ties into other areas as well. Those are images of the cavalcade taking the two leaders. We can confirm that they're both sitting in the same car. Both Prime Minister Modi and Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed are sitting in the same car as they make their way towards the summit venue where bilateral talks will be taking place. There's a big dinner for the visiting UAE president uh, later this evening, as is customary. Prime Minister Modi, remember is the one who had begun and conceptualized the vibrant Gujarat summit uh, way back when he was chief minister of Gujarat and it continues to this day annually and has become a showpiece for investment and business in Gujarat. It was a showpiece for the Gujarat model as well that the prime minister has spoken about many, many times before. The prime minister and Mohammed bin Zayed, or MBZ as he's frequently called in the Western press, making their way now through Ahmedabad as the crowds line up to catch a glimpse of the two national leaders. Prime Minister Modi, of course, wildly popular, uh, especially in Gujarat, uh, son of the soil, a uh, state to which he travels uh, uh, fairly frequently, not as frequently as he would like, I'm sure, uh, but a state uh, that is obviously very, very special to him. The vibrant Gujarat summit is something that he had overseen, he had uh, given birth to in the state of Gujarat.